Hello everybody, Craig Lighthizer here, Cash of Craigie. Um, recently this week I changed my uh, Facebook cover and put my website up here and obviously didn't do a good job because this is getting hit on our near. I don't know what you guys see. I don't know what you guys see. Get out of here. Um, anyway, so in the process of doing that, I used to have the unit of prosperity one up, but with all the drama that's going on um, since a week ago yesterday, um, the unit of prosperity um, has changed and gone a different direction. So I decided that since I'm not going in that direction, I was going to make a new Facebook cover. And as a result, a lot of people have been uh, Facebooking me and want to know how I did it. Well, so I just want to put together this quick training, and if you do that in the process, stay to the end. I'm going to show you a cool marketing trick you can do while I'm uh, shooting this video. Anyway, so the object is to put a new cover page. What I did here to do this, to make this, get these letters up here and get this there, was to just go to Google, and I typed in, um, I went, typed in, uh, the era of domination. I saw this somewhere else on Facebook. I just went over here. I went to images. Grabbed that. I viewed it. And then I just went to Jing, okay? And I just took whatever size I wanted. Now, before you do that, I mean, you can start up in here. You can start there you can also when you capture the image you can also um, write some text in here and do it that way but let me show you a cooler way to do it um, let's just save this I'm gonna save this also another thing you can do too, keep in mind the keywords that you're doing if you're doing it for a uh, your website um, Hang on just a second. Let me put this on pause. All right. Sorry about that. Um, anyways, what you can do is you can go in here and put your keywords. Like mine's Cash with Craigie. It's kind of what I, I'm trying to market. Cash with Craigie. And I'm just going to name those keywords there. I'm going to save it. All right. Then, you know, from there, what you can do is you go over to Pick Monkey. Yeah, I'm going to save that. Pick Monkey is so easy to use and it's free and you can do a bunch of stuff real fast in pick monkey it's just like this pick monkey um it's free you can crowd around here but for me i just when i'm doing things fast i don't have enough time during the day so i just go out here i'm going to find that and uh what do i call that uh Cash or Craigie. You can spell Craigie right. Okay. Now, down here at the bottom, we can resize this. All right. We're going to resize this. And if you look over at, I pulled this up. I found this today in the Help Center in Facebook or whatever. I Googled it. Googled it. What are the dimensions of my fan page or my page profile picture and cover photo? And then it's got a laid out section here. Tells you exactly what it is. So, for this purpose, you can read through this later. But I just Google it. We're going to do 851 by 315. So, I'm going to make this. I'll just leave this at 874. Okay, then what we're going to do is we're going to crop it to that size. Gonna, because it's bigger. So, we're going to go 814. What's that number again? Let's just go back and check, shall we? 851 by 315. Eight. 851 by 315. So there we go. There's our working canvas. So the way I was looking at that, I think I'm going to leave a little bit more room. I may even replace this. I'm going to leave a little bit more room down here at the bottom to give that space that I was looking at there and so that I can get this up a little bit closer. 
So let's go back to pick monkey. Okay, and I'm gonna update a fly. And then I'm gonna save my masterpiece. I've already got it labeled the what the what I want. Sean happens to be the higher quality. And then I'm gonna save it to my computer. Okay, I should Craig notice I spelt it wrong, that's fine for purposes of what we're doing. Okay, now I'm gonna put some text on it. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna put the text, it's gonna come up any day now. Uh, all these different fonts. I mean, they have every type of font you could possibly want. Let's do quicksand just for fun. And I'm going to add text. And then you're going to just grab your little box and you're going to put it up here. I'm going to do this like I showed you earlier. I'm going to do cache with Craigie. www.cash with Craigie. Things come out. I don't really want to be on the internet. It's my own name. Can't even spell my own name. Okay, and I'll spread this out a little bit. I don't really like that font. Yeah, it's not too bad. And then let's just say I want to put some color in there. I'm going to make that red. Okay. I'll just do it like that. Then I'm going to add some more text, and we'll make some kind of slogan. I'll add it here just for the sake of time and make this video not go long. I'll move it over here. And I'm going to type in there. Oops, excuse me. I'll move it over here. Make it red too. And uh, helping, helping others. Sell on eBay, whatever. Come up with your own slogan, whatever you want to do. Move it around, move that guy around here. Take that, spread it out a little bit. Move it over there. And, you know, this gives you a guideline. Like I said, that website right there, this uh, Facebook Help Center, gave you a little guideline. But there we go. I did it. You know, I could put a picture in here, um, I could go through each one of these tools. But it's free. It's free software. Put images in there. You can put your own overlays in it. Um, it's really cool. So anyway, guys. All right. Let's go back. Oh, I promised you to show you a really cool marketing tip. People click on pictures, by the way. So people click on this. You can go in here and add the description. And then Facebook allows you to do put your capture page in here. So I can go HTTP, boom, boom, www.cashwithcraigie. Isn't that crazy? I can't even spell my own name. C-R-A-I-G-I-E. I can type all day long and I can't. And it allows me to put that link in there. So when people click on my picture, they'll click right there to my link. So guys, with that, this video is running a little bit long, but uh, I wanted to show you guys how to use PicMonkey to create a cool fan page. And by the way, just, just to let you know, you can do the same thing for this one. Oh, nope, they changed it. Facebook changes every day. They changed it out of my area. Anyway, guys, with that, you got any questions, uh, hit me up on Facebook. Hey, if you join my team tonight, if you join my DSD team tonight, send me proof that you joined tonight. I will give you a two hour coaching call for free this weekend on Saturday. So if you join tonight before three o'clock in the morning Eastern Standard Time, send me a screenshot that you joined or I'll give an email. If you do, I'll give you a two hour free coaching session this Saturday night. So guys, with that, there you go. Have a great night.